Charlotte, can you talk a little bit about the clinic in Mexico and the history of that? And is there anything here in the United States that, that people can, can go to for this therapy? There are laws in the United States that make it illegal to cure cancer. You can't. As a doctor or health practitioner, you're not allowed to treat cancer with anything but radiation, surgery, or chemotherapy. And if you do, you're a felon and go to jail. You can't heal cancer. Mm -hmm. In Mexico, it's different. We, our doctors in Mexico, are able to use a nutritional therapy and uh, it's not condoned, and it's more carefully examined after NAFTA. Because with NAFTA, North American Free Trade, you know, the doctor started more or less to invade and do things and pressurize the health department in Mexico. But we are still able to heal. Just today at the lecture downstairs, I had a young man, well, a young man, I don't know how old he is. He must be in his middle 50s or so. For me, that's young. <laughs> um, who is now three and a half years cured of spreading metastasized melanoma, which is incurable. We have lots of those cases, and there's not one. He just happened to be here. He offered to come and testify, okay? But we have hundreds of those cases. Not just melanoma, but pancreatic cancer where orthodox medicine is, is helpless. They don't know what to do. They have no responses. Uh, okay, so we have people uh, recovered six years, 10 years, 12 years, 15 years. One lady is now recovered 24 years, but in good health mm. and working and functioning and active. That's what we feel we can do we can restore people to full function and health, and that's what matters.